Yo, what up guys, mm. and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. In this video, we are going to be making a modern, futuristic, scientific, well, kind of thing. So, um, let's just hop straight into the video with this. Uh, you don't have to make this, this is basically just as a backdrop for when I do it. And all you're going to need in this video is uh, quartz blocks or white concrete if you were to use white concrete or uh, is it slice? Slice? I can't really say it. Um, it's this white block here. Uh, site Um I'm going to use site You don't have to. I'm going to use red concrete and I'm going to use blue concrete. You can use whatever two colours you'd like to use. You'll need one water bucket and you'll need glowstone or sea lanterns if you can get sea lanterns. The first thing we'll do is go one in the middle, we'll go one, two to the right and then one, two to the left. We'll then go to the right of these five strips and we'll go one, two. We'll turn to the right and we'll go one, two again, we'll go one, two, three, four, five, dropping a one block down and then we'll go two again, so one, two. We'll turn to the right and we'll go one, two, again. We'll drop down one and we'll go one, two, three, four, five. Then we'll go up one and we'll go one, two, and we'll drop to the right and we'll go one, two, and we'll go one, two, three, four, five. Then we'll go one, two, and then turn to the right and we'll go one, two. We'll dig this out real quick like this get it all gone quick as anything speedy gonzales speedy gonzales uh, just like this let's get it all empty and you'll want to dig this down too Once done, you should have something like this. Too deep circle. What we'll do, we'll go one around this ledge, just like this. Film them all in, not joining the corners, so you're going up, just one around the edge. Yet again, not filling the corners to make the white circle with your quartz or your salsite or whatever you'd like to use, white concrete, whatever brick you'd like to do of your choice. I'd recommend doing it with this block, it does look the nicest. And then you should have one circle just looking like this. What we now need to do, we need to find the middle point of this um, circle. So if we get our grass block just as a marker, we'll go to the middle, and I think that's the middle there. Find the middle, and to make sure it definitely is the middle, you go here, and you go here. So, you, so both things cross at this point. So that here is the middle block. What we now need to do, we need to get your cell site. You need to go one, two, three, lantern, one, two, three, lantern, one, two, three, lantern, just like so. Looking nice, looking clean, looking very, very fresh. And if you want to go taller, you are more than welcome to go taller. So one, two, three, and then go lantern on top. Just make sure there is a lantern on top and then it will look very nice and very clean like that. So, so what we need to do, we need to go to this middle block. We need to go one, two, and on the third one, place the red or blue block or whatever color of your choice. Move to the right of this and go one and two. Here, we then move to the right of this block and go up one and we place one, two, and th three, just like so. And then here, in survival, you'd be like this. 
you want to go here, go onto the second block just like so, and bring this out like this, and you need to go one, two, like this, yes. So you need to go like this, just like so, and then you need to go here, to the back, and you need to go up, like this. And then you need to go one more, and you need to go one, and up. So it should look something like this. Okay, it is three, three. You need to go three. So one, one, two, three on the angle, and then three, 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 just leaving one block as such. And then when we go back to the top of this, we'll come here to the second block again, just like so, you come out like this, you go one, two, so then that is three, one, two, three. And then here again, you go out one, like this, and you go one, two, three. And then again, you go one, two, three. And one more, one, two, three. And then on the angle, just like this. And then you go one, two, three on the angle and then you go straight again so let's go one bring it over here delete that and go one two three and then again one like this one two three and again one two and three let's take a quick look so it should look like three one on the corner three one on the corner three, one on the corner, and then the two at the bottom. Just like this, so it should slowly swirl up nice and gently. So what we need to do is bring this one here, just bring it out one like this, and go one, two, three, on the angle, and on this one, we need to go up one, like this, like this, so on the angle, on the angle again and then go one and then go like this just the one so it is flat and it is straight with that middle one nice easy and simple and we also need to make this a three and that two nice and simple nice and easy and if we bring this one here do another one it should be like a three along the side which looks very nice looks very very clean <coughs> now what we need to do where we, where we started the red one here, right at the bottom, we need to get your opposite colour of your choice. You need to go to the opposite side and we're going to go one, two, three, like this. And then we need to go one, two, and then we go on the angle, one, two, three. And then we go one, two, three, four, delete the bottom block. And then there we start, we go one, two, three. And then we go up again, one, two, three. And then we go into the corner, like this, and go one, two, three. And then go again, out, one, one, two, three. Up one, one, two, three. Up one, one, two, three. And then we go on the angle again. So we go one out and in, one, two, three. And then out and in again, like this, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And then we go out and in again, just like that, and go one, two, three, and then we go out and in again, just like that, one, two, three, one, two, and then one, just like that. So it looks exactly flat at the top, just like this. Now, once you're at the top, you get your water and you go tap on the top. That will flow all the way through, come all the way down. And what you want to do, you want to fill this in with water, making sure all the water is all flat, not flowing. So it looks like it's just going in, it's going back up and pumping back down. Then what you want to do, you want to come to the corner of each thing and you want to go one in, you want to do that and put uh, a sea lantern or glowstone of your choice. Go here, one in, glowstone, sea lantern, 
in, one here, one in, glowstone, sea lantern, one here, one in, and glowstone, sea lantern. And there we have it guys, we have one very nice water fountain which is scientific, it's modern, obviously you can do your choice, they could be red, they can be green, if you wanted to do it toxic, you could have like black and yellow or whatever choice you would like. But at this moment, it's looking very nice and it's looking very clean. Look how modern and smart that looks. And even if you wanted to go one step further, you could get some white stained glass, just like this. Grab it, just like so, and then around the edges, do this, just so it looks nice and clean and stuck together. If you are going to put the glass in, like this, you will need to delete each outer, outer corner like this and put white blocks like so to make the railing connect all the way around, which doesn't look bad make too much of a difference to the build so it looks nice enough you could even do this even if you weren't doing the railings connect it if you wanted more of a smoother design but preferably I don't do it the cheat nice easy and simple all the way around one two three two three one I'm gonna do one two three one two three one two three but yes guys there we have it one nice looking water fountain for you guys scientific and modern so get it stuck into your build this could be a nice really nice centerpiece of a roundabout or even a little town that you're making but guys thank you for joining another tutorial with me greatly gummy and i'll see you all in the next one stay gummy bye